London. From Heathrow and other airports in the country, millions this year will fly to the continent for their holidays and even further afield. This is the holiday pattern of the jet age. Our great-grandfathers used to have the time of their lives often no further from home than up the river. Romance achieved marvels at Bolter's Lock. Very few in those days thought of going abroad. The female bravely confronted the ocean in 1897. It didn't take a fortune, this seaside holiday, although those newfangled motor cars cost quite a lot of money. Individual transport came cheaper. Sometimes the holiday came to a sudden end. Thousands in the 20s discovered a new thing called hiking. Every year, more and more people became holiday-minded. Cruising became the fashion in the 30s. For the first time, thousands sampled the joy of going to sea on liners. Sun, freedom and wonderful food, if you could hang on to it. Amusing to look back to the vanished age before World War I, when the idea of choosing a holiday place a thousand miles away would have been utterly fantastic. This was the era of holidays at home. That was yesterday.